Hello there. Welcome to Diction's Kitchen. Today we're going to be cooking something that doesn't have any meat in it. So, get wrecked, carnivores. Dun -dun 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 -dun, Diction's Kitchen. <laughs> I've never cooked this before. It's uh, sauteed portobello mushrooms and onions. And that's it. And uh, it's pretty much just all about cook time and adding some some, some flair, some spices or whatever. I'm gonna add some garlic powder and, and salt and stuff. Hopefully it'll taste good. Um, it's an experiment. We're doing this for science, okay? It's not even about being healthy. It's just about trying new foods. Because I can cook about six different meals and they're all getting really fucking boring right now. So let's try something new. What do you want? What do you want, Marla? What do you want? Let's get started. All right, first thing we gotta do is dice up these uh, mushroom caps right here, and then I'm gonna do half of an onion, and uh, just chop that up pretty pretty roughly. So here we go, fast mode engage. This is a lot of mushroom, so I think I'm gonna uh, save, I don't know, save this one, and make that with another meal. Oh my god, would you shut up? Alright, <clears throat> get a get your little skillet here, warmed up to a little, little over medium heat, and uh, basically I just dump them in, I think. Yeah. There we go. Get all in there. Gotta kinda position them so they get you know cooking thing. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. Fuck off. Uh, so basically we want to get these to be, uh, like, we want the mushrooms to be black and, you know, the, the onion, you know how to cook an onion, just, just nice and kind of golden, syrupy looking. And uh, to add some flavor, uh, put, oh, Jesus, some pork poured out. Garlic powder, yeah, fucking garlic is the shit. Um, uh, some sea salt, it's always good. And pepper, black pepper. And uh, I guess we just we just saute this until you know get the desired effect. Basically, might actually drizzle some more olive oil on the top. Olive oil. I forgot to mention that. Yeah, that's what I cook with because it's way better than butter. It's nicer. All right, just let that cook up for a few minutes. I guess. I hope. I don't know. I didn't really read the directions too thoroughly. <laughs> I'm a chef. All right, so now, uh, as you can see, the mushroom caps, the slices have turned into tiny brown mustaches. Isn't that cute? So, um, I mean, I guess you could leave this on even more if you wanted to cook it a little more thoroughly. They said, the, the instructions said wait until they, they turn black, but I just took a taste test and they, they're very, uh, um, what do you call it, squishy. They're, they're, they're not, Marla, I'm, I'm cooking here. They're, uh, it's got a good cons consistency. And uh, the onions look to be cooked all the way through. Um, they're not, you know, they're not like all destro destroyed and stringy. Destroyed. I don't know what I'm saying. Um, brown mustaches. All right, there you have it. You can see it. Looks pretty good. Yeah. Um, pretty simple. But that took me all of like 10, 15 minutes to cook that up. Nice little snack. I mean, it's not really its own meal. I think this would be pretty good next to like a pork chop or something, you know? Like that would actually taste pretty good. Actually, that pork chop, I should do that next time. Um, one of the extra flavor, I don't know, hot sauce, I got sriracha. I've been putting that on everything these days. And um, even ice cream, you know, because how the fuck not? Mmm. Mmm. That's really good. I'm not a huge mushroom person, too. That's the fucked up part. Um, I like mushrooms on things, you know, as part of a meal, like on pizza or in like a salad or something. But this is pretty much just mushrooms with onions. And, uh, you know, you can add your own spices to it, whatever you want to spice it up and give it a little extra flavor, whatever flavor you like. But on its own, this is a pretty goddamn good snack. And I imagine, I mean, aside from the fact that we cooked it in a shit ton of olive oil, not terribly unhealthy for you. So, uh, yeah, if you're into veggies, I try this out. It's pretty simple. All right, see you next time on Diction's Kitchen. You know what, hold on. Say bye, Marla. Bye.
Focus. Auto focus. Focus. Hold on. Can I make it focus? There we go. Dixon's kitchen. <laughs>